Let's go, Dazzlers. Welcome back to Daz Games, and we are back with the second part. Madison, this game has been insane so far. I've loved it. Let's get back into it. When we left off, we found out that our family was dealing with a shit ton of possession, and maybe our grandmother and grandparents were possessed. My dad seems to think I'm possessed, and um, he's trying to kill me. This camera is revealing a lot of secrets. All right, yeah, so we did the picture puzzle last video, guys, and that was quite a tricky one. They all had to add up to 43. And now, now we have this. What's this? Ooh. Is that a lighter? All right. Oh, okay. Oh, that's gonna be creepy when we use that. Okay. Oh, damn. All right, so we're using it straight away. These pictures are everywhere. There are handprints on the walls. Yes, I can see that. Man up. Yep. Oh, I don't like this at all. I don't like how it goes out like that. The handprints stopped. Yep. Yep. Just off. Oh. Jesus Christ. Not a fan of this area. Where are we going? Wait, let's go through here. Jesus Christ, Christ Almighty! I can't. I can't deal with that. Right, so we went left, didn't we? That's the rule of a maze, isn't it? Just keep on going! I knew that was going to happen. I knew it. Ah! before I was rudely interrupted guys was the rules of a maze are you keep going left until you reach a dead end you turn back and then take the next left wait all right I'm gonna swing it away what the hell no don't don't start that shit I can't go that way ah oh, see dead end I'm going back this way. God, God damn it, Lord! Oh my God, that's horrendous. Absolutely horrendous. Okay, so I have been walking through here for what seems like a decade now, and I, I am still no closer to finding out which way to go. I'm gonna keep going left. I'm gonna stick to my rule of left is right. Keep walking down, and you'll see that my my plans are correct. Ah, oh, God! Keep going the same way. over that, no? Alright, we'll try going right then. Oh! Follow her, follow her, follow her. Yeah, there she goes. Look, she's leading me. Yes! She's helping me. She's awesome! Let's go! I gotta get out. Yeah. Why help me then do the- Oh my unholy lord. And unholy is the word for it. You find a basement like this. You don't just move house. You move country. Oh my god. Gotta get out of here. Where am 
right now. Some sort of graveyard. What the f- oh, it's a leaf. Oh, Jesus Christ. A graveyard? Yeah. How, graveyard. how did I get here? You're losing. You're losing it, mate. Made up. You've been like, oh wait, cathedral. We're going down. Really? What are we doing? God. God, I'm gonna say, oh my lord. How did I end up here? Yeah, fell. Well, this is uh definitely abandoned. Bible art is two thousand twenty two. That is the date. What's oh, that maze thing again? Don't think I need it. 1987. Okay. This is 1987. Do I take a picture of this? Yep. It's 51. Are these the dates of, like, the victims? <laughs> Very dark. For this a second, is impossible. Then. This place didn't look like this a second ago. Now it's all done up again. Ah, oh, the safe. I store the tape in there for later because we didn't actually get a chance to listen to that. Mad Sun Hale. Madison Hale. Is this her coffin? The eye is missing. Why would the eye be missing? her name. It's important. Especially when someone's died. Okay. This looks safe. Like a nice red light bulb in a horror game. Let's us know everything's gonna be cushy. Okay. Wow, everything's a maze in this section of the game. Okay. I don't know quite what's going on in here. Should we have a look at the other one over there, which is green? This looks like it could lead somewhere nice. Still terrifying though. Okay. I follow the green light. Alright, what we got here? Ah. Alright, so I've got three things that I need to put on here. I guarantee you I find those in the red wing. Uh huh. There's also three things here. Could this be violin? Maybe what these guys are holding or something? Maybe there's something in the church. Right, let's maybe look in the main hall over here. That's a safe. That's where I came from. Bell tower, yellow maze, blue maze, green maze, red maze. Oh my god, there's so many mazes. The color of death, the color of wine, 
The color of Jesus' blood. Red. The color of life. The color of peace. The color of our little angels. Okay. What's this here? A candle. We're gonna take that with us. Now we've got some sort of bell here. What are these leaflets here? Yellow maze. Ah, okay. The Jupiter Cathedral. Our maze is getting updated every year. Alright, so that's the route. That's the actual shape of the mazes on the leaflets. Alright, so in my inventory, I got a red candle. And there was something back here that said about. Ah, hold on. You have to take photos of everything in this game, I swear to God. Oh, look! Okay, that comes out green. Blood of... That's got to be red, right? Still, that doesn't tell me anything at all. Um, Why would it have three different dates? Ah, hold on. Wait! It goes back to that time. Okay, no wonder there's a safe there. Oh, that's the blue candle. And uh, maybe I'll go back to here. Alright, so I can just grab one. Alright, so that's uh, modern times when it's a bad... That's 1987. That's where I was first of all. So let's go to 1951. Let's see where it's at. Okay, so this is 1951. I've not been in this one yet. Okay. Oh, yeah, it looks all different. <laughs> Confession box, maybe? Hello? Ex excuse me? Be a good mother. Nancy. I did it. I, I, I finally did it. I. Did you have to understand? It was like living with a monster. No, he never loved me. He was a liar. He lied to me. He lied to you. He lied to everyone. He, he was a liar. He. He lied to himself. He tried to pretend he didn't have the past. He did. He wasn't a vile, disgusting, despicable piece of garbage. You know, he just wanted to marry me, to get away from his crimes. He knew he couldn't stay in Germany. He knew, he knew his past was coming to get him. He knew it. He, knew. he, he tried to pretend it was all... So all the mazes are here in all the possible realms. She's still praying. Um, I've got a blue candle, right? And a red candle. So... Maybe if I get them from all the different realms... I don't know what realm each candle is supposed to be in, though. There's no... Significant order that seems to be in place. Alright, so we found the blue room here. Right, um, she was like, let me have a look at my pictures actually, because, she was blue. Okay, so if I put the blue, let's just see what happens, I guess. The cult wears tears. Okay, so that one's right. So if we look at pictures, which one's red? Jesus is red. Oh wait, can I put that there? No. Okay. So that one's in the right place, for sure, because something happened. I'm gonna go to the red one in this year. I don't know if you need to go to another year and use the candles in different years to signify something. It's not really that clear. Um, but I'm going to try and find the red room 
now. There's the yellow one across the way. I still have... Do I have to find one or two other candles? Where's the red one? The red one's down here, right? Okay, and it says that Je the Jesus painting is the red one. So if we put the candle in front of Jesus, it should... It should give us something. Right, here we go. Right, there's Jesus. Right, let's see if this works in this year. The color yes. Of Jesus. Right. Okay. And yet you can't. I can't lift it off. So they're definitely in the right place because I can't take it back. Now the other ones. Let's have a look here. So Jesus, green was the angels. So I need to maybe go to the modern era and have a look. Because I, I don't think I got the candle from modern times in 22. Let's have a look around with this candle. Ah! A yellow That's candle. Yellow. One more, right? Blue, red, yellow, blue. Yeah, we've done the blue one. Did we? We didn't do the green one, did we? Where do we get the green one from? Alright, well, maybe because she's in this realm, she can like help me get the candle. Like. Your kingdom come. I don't. Oh, hold on. oh she's got a note. He is here. Who? Your kingdom come. Your will be done. Who's here? I need another candle. Oh wait! There. Oh my God! Blue candle. All right. Which one was it? Huh. All right. Let's try and find the blue. Ah, God! <laughs> my 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 hand. What the fuck was that? I, I gotta get out of this place. <laughs> yeah. Shit. Where's the blue? Hello, blue. Right there it is. Here. Oh my god. I don't like that at all. All right, this is definitely the last candle, and then I guess we get to see what happens. I'm just gonna die! What is going on? Ah! No, not a fan, not a fan, not a fan. I'm just gonna fucking die. No, that's the wrong way. I need to get this candle done. Oh god, what is the fucking way? Ah! What? Am I dead? Wait. I'm back here. There won't be anything down here. Straight right. And then right. Okay. Um, I think it's for him. No. Maybe for them? Yes. That is now all the candle. The bell. That's the bell. The bell tower. Wow, what a unique puzzle. Like, I've never, never had to go through that. What's that? Wait, wait, did that say confession? <gasps> Conf 
confession key. That unlocks the confession key, so we have to go back to 1951, where she's having confession. And that should unlock it. Alright, now we're making some progress. Now, now we're on the way. Alright, back to 1951. And I'm about to unlock some shit. There it is. Yeah, I thought there'd be nothing in there. Hans Goring? Hans Goring, 1951. Whoa. What is that? Wait, what does it say? Examine. Letter I. <laughs> Shit. The I is missing. It's the I in Madison. Get out of here. Hurry up. Hurry up. It's the I in Madison. He said the I is missing. That should lower the coffin. Madison Hill, 1944-1987. Oh my god. Now what? Yes! Fuck, you have to do it in the right... Oh my god, what is that? Skull. It's not a foot, is it? Oh, wait. What? No. How trippy is this? So we've gone out of a memory and now we've been jumping through time. Can I take a picture? Let me go back. Let's see what's happening here. Man, I'm so engrossed. <laughs> it's sealed off. What? Both ways are sealed off. That's not good for me. Why do I feel like another puzzle is incoming? Go back up. Oh, it's dark now. Hmm. Alright. So, both ways. Camera's not doing anything. So what? Maybe if I open it, if I walk away, will it close? Let's have a look. It's going to be some sort of pattern here. Oh. What? Crap. Alright, it's just play it's just playing up but there's no particular puzzle here, I don't think. I think it's just playing games with me. The hell is going on? <laughs> ah, God! Shit, run, run, run! Run! Yep, I was right! I was right! God Jesus Christ! <laughs> yeah, the <laughs> Oh, Mary, I'm so happy to see you. Mwah! Where are all the pictures gone? There's still a floorboard here. Still can't use anything here to pry it up. Right, so I've got her skull now. What would that do? How can I use her skull? Wait, the phone. John? John? This is the fourth time I've tried to call you. Priest Thomas speaking. I was able to finally get the information you asked for, and the truth is... The truth is, 
I'm worried about your family. Generally speaking, demons try to complete simple rituals to break the bondage of their souls. To carry out this ritual, you must rid yourself of an object with important sentimental value to you. Offer it as a sacrifice. There were practitioners of witchcraft who became haunted as a result of their thievery and dishonesty. They used to steal jewelry from ancient dynasties as to avoid performing the sacrifice directly for themselves with their own sentimental objects. They bought the sacrifice with the emotions of others. But this perverse being is trying to go beyond even that. We are speaking of an ancient ritual of which very little is known. Seven sacrifices, seven mutilations. I believe we are facing a, a, a body exchange type of ritual. Madison Hale was trying to complete such a ritual before she was murdered, and now she is forcing your child to finish it for her. She is trying to steal your son's body. body Call me ritual? as soon as you get this message. Is that what she's after? Who's murdered? I'm watching these insects. They early on in the game, every time I've said to follow insects, it says follow them. And look, they all lead in here. Where are they going? Wait, there's something next to it. Oh. I think there's something else under that plank. Well, we can't get it. What's the key? Basement key. All right. That's our next objective. Where's the basement? Well, the basement is down here, so... The generator's going, which I... Worked. Okay, let's go... But it's red as well, there's the red door. Now, we've been through the red door with the camera. Let's try that, shall we? There it is. Alright. So Madison was murdered. Very clearly work that out. The bar is in the basement. This is the basement. What the hell is this place? What? Oh shit. Light here. Wait. Wait, there it is. I got it. Shit. I got the crowbar. One left. I don't know. I'm kind of just guessing right now, guys. <laughs> Jesus. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, wait. Christ! I have never been so happy to get out of a basement. She doesn't show in the photos. Somehow, the photos of her. That's Madison, I bet. Oh, things 
it. Things are getting really intense now. I think we might be nearing the end of this, guys. Crowbar. Right, let's go back to this room. I've like, really memorised the layout of the house now. There was also a toilet with something on, if I remember correctly. Is this the ring she mentioned in her diary? There's a ring, Elizabeth and Albert Maxwell. That's the sentimental value. <laughs> oh, crap. My, my eyes. My eyes burn. God. I, I need to get out of this fucking house. So she got the ring. Open the notebook. Wait, chair. I can't turn it around. I think, um, if I remember correctly, there is another, there's a floorboard, if I remember, up in the attic. Um, the crowbar, I've still got it. So, it's got to be something else under there, because I don't know where to put that ring. Maybe the, the Mary fig, the statue? Place it there, because the, I think that's going to be used for whatever sacrifice... We're planning. Alright, let's use this and get this out of here and see what... What's that? If you hey. find this, do not listen. Well, I'm gonna listen to it because I need to progress. Alright, let's, let's listen. these things. Ah. Yeah, I need some sort of bolt cutters or something to open this. There's something in here. What's this? Oh, wait. What was that? <laughs> Triangular key. <gasps> That's some... Um... That's towards the beginning. Right? I'm sure. But it doesn't fit in here, does it? No. It's th that's that's over here. Oh wow. <laughs> where, where did these come from? What is this? A skull. Alright, that's meant to go there. Oh, Christ! Sentimental value. The ring. And the pictures. There's the ring. This is gonna start the sacrifice. Grab 
What is that? Triangular key. Triangular key. Still don't have a code for that. Let's have a look in this book, shall we? Body of exchange ritual. A body exchange Sentiment. ritual? I, I need to put an end to this. Seven sacrifices. Those are the just two bodies. A guest and a ghost. Human ashes. Jesus Christ. Well, I've got the thingy there. Uh, I've got two keys, and I think they go in here. One. Yeah, that's the triangle. And this one. Alright, we might find another piece of the sacrifice in here. What's this? This is from Grandma's diary. Hey, whatever. Um, there will must be like something useful here. Is this skill saw? Ah, bolt cutters. Yes. Okay, but uh, the one in the kitchen. What is this? Okay, we won't play around with that just yet until we need to. I think that might be to get the skill saw working. Okay, so two two objects are placed in the sacrifice. Ah, wait. Let me get these out whilst we're... Oh, what, what a game this has been. Um, let me just... see about this. Yeah, there it is. Wow. And wait, can I put that in there? I, I think I should open it first. This has to be opened. Okay, so I have the final piece, but I have to find a way to open it. All right, let's go through here. There's got to be something in... Oh, I go behind here, don't I? Silly me. Okay, um... Let's go to the toilet. Actually, let's try and open the cupboard first. As it's closer. There's two areas I can use the bolt cutters. Oh, okay. It's another... Secret photograph. Apparently there are 20 of those. Um, I don't really care about those. I'm more interested in picking the story. So let's find the bathroom. Here it is. Alright, so. Do not use. This is one of the first things we found at the beginning of the game and we just haven't been able to... in this house. Al? I'm done with your bullshit. Albert, listen to me. It's just a book. A fucking book, Elizabeth. See? There's no one oh here. God. It doesn't exist. I, it's not real, goddammit. I know. Everything that's happening to me has something to do with it. I just know it. It's a disease, Elizabeth. You are sick for the Lord's sake. Now she's no, cast. Sick. You'll end up losing your mind if you don't cut the crap. That book has nothing to do with your illness. I wish you'd stop acting like a child. Stop hiding our stuff and take your goddamn pills. Jeez! Whoa. Do you think it's normal? Do you think pupils vanish like dust? I'm telling you that that, that fucking thing is what's causing Enough, this for me. Enough, Elizabeth. Stop acting like a ten-year-old and go to bed. Albert, everything started the day we brought that fucking book to this house. It's a disease, Elizabeth. If you don't sick. believe me, I will leave this place. I'm done. And I'm taking Johnny with me. We are not staying wait, here. Wait, wait a minute. This is... Oh, this is too oh no. You're paranoid. Ellie, it's, it's 4 a.m., Elizabeth. Just, just go back to bed before we wake up Johnny. Come on, there's not much I can do, guys, but listen. You'll end up all alone. 
Just you and your stupid fucking clock! She just like the clocks. Yep, that's it. No. No. Oh shit. Oh god. No, sorry. Fuck off. Not interested. So I have a concrete block. It has a handle on it. It's got to have something to do with that saw. Must be able to get this to cut somehow, right? Shit. Up, up, down, up, up, up. Alright, up, up, down, up, up, down. Alright, that one's done. Up. Uh, up, oh, no, down, down, up, down, down, no, down, down, up, down, up, up. That's working. Wait, I can open that. Yes. What's the concrete block? Oh wow! Now we're actually going to see what's inside here. These must be Madison's victims. Oh my god. Alright, we've got it. We've got the final piece. I still don't know what that block is. Alright, here we go. Sacrifice begins. Oh yeah, there's just a million combinations. All right, so the next up, oh. Tape number three. All right, so we need to find that code. That is the final thing to, for some reason to get that sacrifice started. Let's go listen to this tape first. John, I must stress to you how dangerous these demons really are. I've witnessed a few exorcisms in my time. Not everyone lived to tell the tale. These beings are not alive, and that makes them stronger than us. They entertain themselves with us. They enjoy our fear, causing us pain. They feed off of it. It gives them power, it gives them strength. So when scary, one of them possession. becomes attached to one of us, it's all but impossible to stop. <laughs> they play with our bodies and minds Does this mean that until they find what they were yeah, looking that woman for. Is attached to the no camera? Human. What? Attached they are to me? beyond everything we know. John, I implore <laughs> She's you. She's no longer human. Seek she... help. I'll investigate that woman you told me about. Um, Madison Hale. And I'll get back to you as soon as I find something. Keep all of this information away from your son. Get rid of that camera as soon as you get this message. Oh, please. Crap. The camera's cursed. Please do be careful. If your child has already had contact with this entity, his life, yours, and your family's are in Mom. jeopardy. Chanel. What have I done? You just uncovered everything. I need to find a way to end this. Yeah. Fuck. Oh no, the uh, hand's doing it again. Uh, it burns. Uh, oh, shit. It's black. My body burns. Uh, Give me something. I need to find where that code is. Horror horns? Oh, wait. Horns? It can't be. It I is. think I've seen something like this. Yeah, this is Not it. In the house. 
Yeah, I was right in front of it. Four. That's one of the things. No, no, no. Wait, another vision? No, not, not again. No, fuck. I, I can't feel my fingers. What is happening to my body? Alright, another clue. Uh, light bulb. I, I don't know what this could mean. There was oh, a red crap. light, but everything was dark. A red light. Wait, where's the um? Where's the generator? Everything went red when I turned the power. What the hell am I doing? There we go. Okay, well I've I've made it red now. So the, the doorbell. I I gotta get to the front door. Wait, the front doorbell. Is that through here? Jesus Christ! That one really got me. Wait, here's the front. Wait. What? It's just playing with my mind. There is no. That red thing. Damn it. Right, so, Robert Hale. Robert Hale was the first victim. Robert Hale, okay, right. So, that was the first victim. Let's leave that there and let's go to number two. So, that was the first victim. I think each floor. We have to, that has to spin and face the victims. Second victim, 71 year old mother. Second victim, 71 year old mother. Crap! That just got destroyed. Is it this one? Hail. Yeah, it's gonna be that one, right? So if two goes here. Yeah, that's it. So she's the second victim. Let's go to the third. I get it now. You have to make each floor per victim make the number face their order. Seven-year-old man. Madison hit his head with a sharp object repeatedly. The young man died instantly. His body was discovered as well. Okay. The third Sorry. victim was a 27-year-old man. Madison hit his head with a sharp object. The young man died instantly. His body was destroyed. Oh no, it's Drake well. Fletcher. <laughs> yeah, I think that one. Drake Fletcher is the third victim. Object repeatedly. Fourth. Wow, this is a great puzzle. It took a while to work out, but if you listen to the guy. Okay, so who's the fourth victim? The final victim 
was a 35-year-old woman. 35-year-old woman. Mine seems, yeah, it's got to be that one with the date hidden. The other fourth one. Or fifth. Whatever. You. You. Alright, now we've got the mirror on the top floor. Take a picture of that, and that should be the puzzle complete. In order of the victims. You, you, you. Okay, let's do it. Yes! What a puzzle. Have a key. What key is this for? Clock key. That's the that's the door with the clock on it at the house. Let's get back down to the ground. Now we can finally unlock that door. That door has been there since the beginning. Holy crap! What a what a game. Oh shit! Now yeah, now now let's get a play. Now we're gonna do some shit. Yeah, go on, do do it. I I get it. I predicted you. I ain't stupid. Yeah, we done me. Oh my god. Like she's getting stronger. Let's go to that clock room. Wait, what was in here? Still that room as well. Jesus Christ, I can't see anything. Okay, right, let's go through here. Where's the clock room? Is this the clock room? I should turn the power back on first. Yeah. Okay, um... Right, the power's back around here. And then we can get in the clock room. Boom! Boom! Back on. Right, let's do this. Clock key. In we go. Oh, we're doing it. Finally. Oh my god, what? Stairs leading down. Creepy ass wallpaper. Oh no, god. another vision. <laughs> my body. Whoa. <laughs> my hands. She mentioned all the clocks <laughs> earlier. What the priest was talking about. That thing is. <laughs> thing is feeding off of me. Got the time? <laughs> Open notebook. Tick what the top. fuck does this even mean? Alright, well, that's a clock. The house um, is full of clocks. Yep. Alright, let's open this. Let's see what we got in this drawer. What is this? Combination. Three left. Twelve. There was another one of those as well. Alright, we're gonna I have to like to work, work this out. There's all these damn clocks. It's locked. Okay, maybe take one of these. Wait, so I've been taking pictures of these notes. There was one upstairs as well. Um, and they, yeah, there, there's the other bit as well. Okay. So, if I'm right about this, um, okay. Right, I've got it. Taking the pictures of all the notes. Now, let's try this. We want to go one, two, three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yes! I've got a clock! Oh, that goes in the, the cuckoo clocks. Shit. Alright, we got it. We got it. Let's go. We're on a roll now. Now, all those things fit in all the, the grandfather clock things. That I've literally been trying to fit things in since the beginning. Still can't get in there. Oh, I don't want to! Jesus! Oh, come on, we're so close to the end. I can feel it. Feel it in my fingers. Right, where's that clock? I'm sort of uh, a bit looped around now. Where are we? 
Okay, so I've got this clock piece. Okay, so. Ah, you fucker! God damn it! Right, so there's loads of these clocks all over the house. Now, what I'm seeing, all the groups of clocks have different times on them. So, like the ones here, they all have 10 past. 5 to 12, which is what was at the beginning. Okay, so what do I have? This is typical escape room shit. So this is 10 past 5. Alright, so where is the 10 past 5 section? Because you can take them out and swap them, I, I found, but then nothing happens. So I think you have to literally group them up. 10 past 5 use. Then you can take that one. Which is 130. Okay, let's have a look. 130. Alright, so that one goes in there. Grab, what one's this one? 820. Okay, so that's 12. They're all 5 to 12. Okay, let me uh, take this one. So I've got the 821. Let's go look at the one at the beginning. God! Bloody Christ! Can't deal with this. I've officially been recording for four hours. Alright, yep, take that brick. I don't want it. The activity in this house is just getting worse. So that's 5 to 12. Give me that one. Yep. I think the cuckoo comes out when it's correct. That one goes in there. Okay, that one's in the right place. Let me swap that one in there. Wait. Wait. I've done it. I did it! Can I just... to have done something. Yep, there we go. What is that? It seems like he never finished this one. Grab. Block. Oh, wait. I can... Oh, wait. I can hang the block on it. What is that bloody... Okay, right. All right. So I I think that the concrete block is meant for that. That's what, oh crap! Another vision's coming. I can't, I can't take this anymore. Yes, yeah, same mate. I just can't. My whole body is going numb. My brain's gone Why numb. Why is this happening to me? Doodle down your shit. This must be a combination or something. What the hell is that now? Wait. Wait. Look at the square. It's a square. It's red. It's the red safe. That's the combination for the red safe. Let me take a picture of this on my phone. Bloody hell. The arrows, aren't I? Okay, so... Done it. Yes, that's it. Okay. Boom! Oh, we got some money. I ain't mean shit right now, Johnny. I'll take the money. You've earned that. Johnny's key. Right, where does that go now? I don't even know. I don't even... I can't even remember. There are some doors that we can try. Alright, I guess that's Johnny's key. Please let there be something a little bit more productive in here. Wait, now the concrete slabs make sense. Um, oh, okay. So that interacts with the camera. Alright, so what's this? In the order to save the bird, 
The rabbit jumped into the air, leaving all her friends behind. The snake below the rat remained while the shark in the depths, the bigger one. So that one has to be the heaviest one, right? So the shark, let's go, yeah, shark plummets. Snake below the rat, so let me grab that one a second and let's see, yeah, so that one goes on there. The snake must be below the rat. If we put this one on there, because it's the lightest one, it should still be higher than the snake. And then maybe hang the clock. Time to save. No. Some say my genius so this is frightening. Is the book that everyone was talking about. This is the book interacts. Oh wow, well, a long, long time ago there was a creature whose name was unknown. It was Gollum. It had lived alone and was often seen on its own. One freezing frosty night it began to feel so very somber that it fell into a deep slumber. By the third day it woke up in blackness with an illness so serious that both its eyes had vanished in the darkness. The creature creeps out of the bed and started crawling looking for the eyes it knew for sure were rolling blue knees is real slivered and rolled so its knees turned blue and sore since its eyes popped and found both and dust and crumbled it is to this day that it does not have a clue but that is no excuse to end the pursuit its eyes now beware those fleeing eyes and make sure to turn on the lights for your own sight is at stake if you cannot escape. He's afraid of the light. Use something to bright protection. The camera. The camera. Oh my god, what is this? <laughs> the room has changed. I don't know. What can I put here? What, what is this? Hi, my name I is know Johnny. this is impossible. But I think Dad wrote this. Alright, so that interacts with that, but it's not... Oh, wait. The door's open. Shit. Jesus Christ. There's got to be something in the safe. It has to be. Alright, if he shows up, just use the camera. Right, let me go back to the... What the fuck was that? Wait. This is the attic. Why is the layout all different? Shit, the basement's locked off. Good, thank you. All right, maybe I need to like play this out. something in there. Wait, where's the other one? Yes! I got it. I got the second eye. Ah, I got him! I got him! Jesus Christ! That was just in time. As well. Otherwise I would have been done for. Right, let's get that second eye in there. And that should finish this. 
God Almighty, what a challenge. Grandma wasn't sick at all. No, she wasn't. This thing is what really killed her. Six zero three. Four six zero three. Shut up, four. I did it. What's that? The ashes. Maxwell. Oh my god. Now we just need a body. <laughs> The ashes are here. Am I gonna sacrifice myself? The camera. There it is. Oh my god. Here we go. Oh, after all this, we, we're just going to kill ourselves. Oh, no. 
final picture. Do we defeat the demon? Oh, wow. Bloody Christ. I mean, I've been playing for, <laughs> for four hours my recording. Bravo. What a brilliant game. Puzzles were very, very hard to understand, but we got there. What a glorious game. What an experience. You're going to see the edited down version of this. You ain't gonna understand what I've been through. <laughs> Brilliant game. Guys, I really hope you enjoyed Madison. I've enjoyed it. It's uh, been a while since we've had a horror game of this calibre uh, to sit through and play. Normally it's just demos. But, uh, brilliant game. Um, I really hope there's another one that comes out soon that um, matches this, but fantastic. Like, love, press my channel, guys. And I'll see you in the next one. Stay dazzling. <laughs>